Uh, prime resins, we offer the, the soy lock in different concentrations. We've got the soy lock 20, the 15, and the 10. That's our B side. Uh, what's mixed in that is our ammonium persulfate. We've got uh, different soil types that we're going to be testing. We've got our organics, our coarse sands, silty sands, the sandy material, a fine sand with silt and clay in our gravels. And uh, I took samples of each of these soils and placed it in this container. And there's different layers of each soil type in that container. And to simulate an, uh, an injection pump, we're using a caulking gun and cartridges. Uh, one side is the A, which is the soil lock. The B side is the ammonium persulfate. Here I'm injecting the soil lock into the container with a drop needle. The drop needle is placed at the bottom of that canister. And as you can see, the soil lock is permeating each one of those soil types. And there you can see it permeating into the silty sandy clays. And then it's going into the, the organic material and into the gravels. And here we're just, I'm just topping off the, the canister with the, the second set of cartridges of the material. Again, this is soil lock 20 that I'm injecting. As you can see here, the soil lock permeated each layer. Here I removed the, the plastic container and this is 24 hours pure. So 24 hours later, this is what you, the end result was of the injection of the, of the material. Again, on the bottom, you had your organics, your gravel, your silty sands, and your sands. Permeated very well. And there I, I cut the sample in half, and you can see how it held that material, binded that material really well with the product. 